please answer. No. Please. No. Why not? Stupid question, sorry. Go away. Al. Leave me alone. No. Why not? Stupid question, sorry. You know why not, don't. Because I can't. You know that. Don't. Alison, please. Why do we have to go through this every time? I don't know why you're so bothered. Don't be mind you, I'm saying bothered. God, you piss me off so much sometimes, Alison. Do I? You know you do. Yeah, I do. I do know. Bet you wish I'd never been oh, born. Don't be so ridiculous. Why do you say those things? Because it's true. If, of course it isn't. Isn't it? It should be. I wish it quite often. That you've never been born? Yeah, I know. You tell me on a regular basis. And that you haven't. I wish quite often that you haven't been born either. No, you don't do anything. No, I'm a bad person, Sarah. I wish you'd never been born. That makes me bad. Even if you meant that, it doesn't make you bad. You're not well, Alison. That's all. Is that what you call it? Don't you ever wonder, though? Um, and what? What it would be like, of course, if I'd never been born. Or, or what the world would be like if you'd never been born. A bloody lot less hard work, I know that. Well, what if neither of us had been? Well, I suppose mum's and dad's lives would be very different. Better, you mean? No, I mean different. Just different. Now, will you please come downstairs and eat something? No. You know what will happen if you keep this up? Yes. Is that what you want? You know what I want. Oh, I wish I did. I want to be left alone. I want all of you to leave me alone. Yes, but we can't, can we? Because when we leave you alone, this, this, this happens. You can say it, you know. I know, I just don't want to. That's because you're jealous. <laughs> jealous? Because you don't have my willpower. You don't have my self-control. <laughs> Alison, love. Why is that, I wonder? Being anorexic isn't being in control. Well, of course you'd say that. You're just the same as them. Desperate to see me get fat. I hate you, and I sometimes hate you, Alison. And so you should. I'm a bad person. No. No, you... You're an ill person. No, I am not ill. I'm in control. Alison, everyone downstairs is waiting to see just how in control you are. Is it any wonder I'm like this, all of you spying on me all the time? Yes, Alison, spying on you to stop you from, from starving yourself to death. If I want to starve myself to death, it's nothing to do with you. Oh, don't be so bloody childish! I am a child. Who wants to be a bloody grown-up if it means being like you? Yeah. Yeah, a child has to be sectioned on a regular basis. Why can't you just eat like normal people, for God's sake? You know why! You know why! Fine. Fine, fine, I'm going downstairs now. Al, it's up to you. You come down, you have a sensible conversation with the doctor, and, um, uh, oh, Emma, is that your key worker's name? You come down, or Amy. It's Amy. She's got to be at least eight stone. How can she bear it? Amy. Come down. Come down now. Oh, 
or let them do whatever they want to do. You really do hate me, don't you? I love you, Alison. But yeah, I hate you too. For this. For giving into it all the time. I'm in control. Oh, God, I need a drink. Do you have any idea how many calories are in a glass of wine? Stop it. Of course, wine is slightly less calorific than beer. Although if you do have to drink, spirits of the least of all. Stop it, Alison. And if you've got to have wine, white is slightly less calorific than red. Alison. But you like your red, don't you, Sarah? Stop gallons of it! it. You can be so... If you drank a bit less, perhaps you could be more like me. <laughs> Why would I want that, Alison? Look at you! Because you can't stop yourself from drinking. Or eating. It's sick. <laughs> it's normal to eat, love. You're the one who's ill. And you're the one who's drunk nearly every night. Yeah. That happened to me too. Well, it'll never happen to me again. At least I'm taking control, making sure. It was so long ago, Alison. You can't change any of it by doing this. I hate him. Well, I know. So do I. No one will ever do that again. But you can't. Look, you don't need to do this to stop that. I am in control. I don't need you. You should have. I don't need you. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing it. No, of course you're not. You never do. You go now. I wonder what life would have been like if she had never been born. Or what the world would be like if I'd never been born. But most of all, most of all, I wonder what our lives would have been like, mine and Sarah's, if he had never been born. Although that would mean... Hmm. Still, got to see the positives in it all, haven't you? What he did to us, me and Sarah, well, it's given me self-control. It's kept me thin and it means I'll never, never, never grow up. Not into an alcoholic grown-up like Sarah or an eight-stone grown-up like Amy. They can section me as many times as they want, but they can't take away my self-control. I'd better go down. They're all waiting. The doctors, the family. And, well, Daddy will only get cross if I don't.